yeah, I think um, kind of little milestones as you go into it. Really, it's it's soon comes round. I put it that way. Um, not something that you really you know keep track of as you play and you just game after game. You know the old cliche. You know what I mean, always looking towards the next game and probably be something obviously that I look back on with with a lot of pride and and yeah, great to make them numbers. Um, but I think. If I am playing tomorrow and we, and we get the three points, that'll, that'll mean probably more than um, you know hitting hitting any kind of figure or, or stat to me at the moment. It's just about getting back on track with uh, with our objective and, and Bolton being the next game to do that. I, I did want to ask though, as a, as a Wednesday fan yourself, you know, ten more appearances, you, are you going to be sort of firmly planted in the top twenty appearance makers of all time at this football club? You know, you, you'll be above David Hurst, around people like Des Walker. I mean, how, how does that make you feel as a Wednesday act specifically? Yeah, to be in that company is obviously it's, it's fantastic. I think every time I pull on this shirt, it's an honour for me being, a, you know, supporting the, the club from a young age and to be around their names is, is great and hopefully to, to be able to um, pass them this season and, and try and get obviously high up on that would be, it'd be great for me and, and um, something that I'm hoping to do. But, um, yeah, I don't really... I was playing it down a little bit, but I don't really, you know, I'm still kind of in full flow in terms of my age and, and how I feel in terms of myself and I feel fit as I ever have. So, um, yeah, I'm not looking to kind of rest on any laurels and, and, and I just want to keep playing as, as much as possible. Absolutely. How was it as well for you, captain in the Saturday video? Obviously not the result you wanted, but it must be a nice feeling for you when you when you get to pull on that armband. Yeah, of course. And, you know, happy to step in and, and, and you know, Obviously, midweek in Sunderland as well, but yeah, it's always it's nice leading the boys out, and um, yeah, not not the result. You know, you're not you're not going to win every time. You, you know, you're the captain, whatever. But I think in terms of wearing the armband, it's it, it, again, you look at the names down the years. But it's it's for me. We've got eleven, or would hope to have eleven leaders on the pitch, and you know, gone are the days where your captain's the most kind of vocal and and a leader in that sense. You get all types of different leaders and. You know, um, each person that you know wears the armband can lead in different ways. And you know, you look at Baz; he's he's got the vocal side, but also his ability. And 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 for myself, you know, setting examples for for people to follow and, and communicating throughout the game and stuff um, as well. So yeah, I think um, it's nice. Something that I kind of was one of my dreams, to be honest, in the youth team and stuff. And. Even then, when you, you got the armband, it was a proud moment. So, uh, yeah, to do that in the first team now and to lead out the boys is really special.